Give all praise and honor, glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, Bashem, Rakaf, Badash. Double honor to the apostles and the elders of great millstone and the sincere Shalom to the Akim that's out there pushing the sincerity and the truth and the sound doctrine. Real quick video, man. So you see another another mass shooting happen um, today. You know what I'm saying? It's a mass shooting every single day, and it and it and it only picks up, you know, more when when holidays like these come around. So like, I, I, it's not gonna be a really really a long video. I don't even know if he's even going to be uh, uh, five minutes. Because here's the thing, man. You know, it's not very much to say about this anymore. I keep saying that. I say that over and over again. What you don't, again, that's another thing. I'm, when I'm getting ready to say this, is another thing that I say over and over again. You people do not understand the power of the Most High. Okay? Y'all don't understand, man, that the Lord is a man of war. Okay? And 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 every every way you look, man, they, they sit up there with, with these Christians and everybody claim to believe in God. Well, you know, I, I just love and I just love and I just love. Man, the Lord is about hatred too, man. Look at this, man. Do you, are you reading this article right here? Are you reading this? Right? Look. The Lord is about war, man. If you read the Bible, if you, if you picked up the Bible and you read it, then you will know that the Lord is about war, man. And all you people out there that say, well, the Bible is written by man. Okay, well, keep shooting each other there, man. Keep shooting each other with your man-made books. Keep smoking your man-made weed. Yeah, because I bet you smoke that shit. Everybody and their great-grandmother smoke weed, man. So keep smoking your man-made weed, man. Right? Keep working your man-made job. Keep wearing your man-made clothes. Because guess what? Every goddamn thing around you is made by man. Keep driving your man-made Mercedes. Keep drop, keep, 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 keep worshiping man, man, right? Everything about every, everything around you is created by people. Everything around you is created by people, including you, right? Here's the thing, man. Again, you don't understand the power of the Most High. The Lord said these things was going to happen. Watch this, look, man. Second, uh, Psalm chapter sixty-five, verse five. By terrible things. What did it say? By terrible things. I'm going to read it again. By terrible things. One more time, man. By terrible things. Because our people are very stiff necked. By terrible things and righteousness wilt thou answer us. Let me read that again. By terrible things and righteousness. By terrible things and righteousness wilt thou answer us. What are those terrible things and righteousness? These. This. Your fuck scenes. The MOTB, your wars, pestilences, riots, all that stuff, man, are all terrible things and righteousness. Why? What makes them righteous? Because they come from the Most High, man. Let me, let, let, let's, let's, let's look at what makes them righteous, right? Because we're we going to come back to this. I keep typing it wrong. We're going to come back to this, to this scripture. What, what makes this righteous? Because the Lord, the, Lord the Lord is not a liar. Okay, and, a, and we are, we understand that this is the Lord's show. This is what you people fail to understand, and this is why you people running around here. Why why are we going through this, and why did this happen, and why did that happen? Why are there so many mass shootings? Why 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 why? We give you the answer, and you know what you do? Ah, uh, you're, you're, you're reading out of a book. Go to numerology. You're reading out of a book. Believe in me, I'm the Messiah. You're reading out of a book. Uh. Uh, you know, just put the but just put the book down and, and 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 stick with the facts. That's what you people like saying. I stick with the facts. The fact is, you are destroyed for a lack of knowledge because you reject knowledge. That's a fact. So, I mean, it's like the Proverbs, chapter sixteen, verse four. The Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai have made all things for Himself. The Lord. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah have made all things for himself. Again, the Lord, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah have made all things for himself. Yea, even the wicked for the day of evil. Even the wicked for the day of evil. That's what makes it righteous. Let's go back. So by terrible things in righteousness will thou answer us, O God of our salvation, who art who art the confidence of all the ends of the earth and of them that are afar off upon the sea. Meaning above all, man. Above all. See, you people, 
Y'all sit up there and y'all worship that bullshit as Egyptology. Y'all worship that that black conscience and all this other BS that you people like worshiping, man. Right? And you don't understand. You, you worship queen in heaven. You know what I'm saying? What you don't understand is that the Lord, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, is the God of gods, the King of kings, the Lord of lords. I don't understand that. Right? Once you understand that, you will know that the Lord is the one that gave all these all these other so-called gods, these piece of shit gods, power. One of the biggest ones, one of the biggest ones is that stupid ass queen of heaven worship. Right? The worship of women. You have the, the dominant species serving the weaker species. How backwards and how pathetic is that? You have the man serving the woman when it should when it should be the woman serving the man. And see, these women out here can say that the one the man the man should serve the woman. When we turn around and say, absolutely not, no, 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 the the woman should serve the man. Now, but suddenly it's a problem. Oh, these women brag about being with multiple partners, right? With multiple men getting bodies, getting fucked by every goddamn thing, right? They brag about that, right? And they get praised for it. They get praised for it. They they don't get they you know what I'm saying? They get they get praised for it. I mean hell they even calling themselves bitches and stuff like that. I mean hell they get they get again they getting they getting they bragging about how many how many so called bodies they done had they done had but all of a sudden, when a man says, "Oh shit, I got shit, I got multiple. I ain't worried about that shit." All of a sudden, oh, you're just a hoe, which a man can't be a hoe. A man can't be a virgin. A man can't be or be, can't be used up. Yeah, I remember, man, we different. See if you see if you as a woman, the lead the lead down with a with, with ten different men. I don't know what the hell been up in you. But it's gonna it's gonna show. This is why you take vinegar baths and shit like that. Oh, it's oh, it's out. It's out, man. It's out. You women are sick, man. So are you men. Everybody's sick. The men and the women, children sick. They all sick. This is why the Lord hey, this is why the Lord is getting ready to come back and burn this bitch. There ain't nothing left for us, man. Ain't so I ain't nothing left for them, man. Right? But guess what? The Queen of Heaven worship, the Egyptology. The, Christ, the plantationism, that shit ain't pretty Christianity. Plantationism, right? Those are all part of the terrible things of righteousness that the Lord is answering us, right? So when we pray for, when we pray for this place to go down, man, you know what I'm saying? Or, or, or he gave us signs to look out for. Matthew 24 and certain other scriptures. Those are all terrible things to look out for. But that's how that but that's how he's answering us. Right? That's how that's how he's answering, you know what I'm saying, his servants. By by the terrible things that we see. By by the Queen of Heaven worship. You know what I'm saying? By the by all these weird, weird doctrines and stuff like that. Those are all terrible things. But that's how he's answering us. Right? He that's how he, that's the, the Lord is known for his, by his judgments. So everybody keeps talking about, yeah, I know the Lord. Well, in order for you to know the Lord, man, yeah, you got to first accept the fact that the Lord is the one that is controlling everything out here. And he creates good and evil. He creates, he He controls Satan. He created Satan. He controls Satan. You have to accept that. There was You have to accept that there was no war. There is There was no war ever in heaven, man. You have to, you have to accept that. Well, I'm talking about as far as that. God versus Satan in a box in, 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 in an MMA match and shit, man. You gotta accept that verse. That that ain't never happened. Right? Because he creates these terrible things. He is the God of gods. He is the Lord of lords. If he's the God of gods and the Lord of lords, how, why in the world, how in the world is he is he fighting Somebody that 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 can't even get past his son. 
And his son is in second, second in command. And his son is the one that controls the spiritual realm, man. Yeah, how is Shai is the one that controls Satan? So he jumped, he jumps over his son to get to the Almighty. Again, a lot of y'all will say this is Satan. You could say that. You could say that. Because it is Satan. In the name of the Lord. <laughs> it's Satan in the name of the Lord, man. Because this place has to go. You really think about what was what's going on here. And all this other stuff. Well, while you're saying this is Satan and this evil and stuff like that. When you look at the, the wars and rumors of wars and them blowing each other up and stuff like that. You got to think about this, man. Satan is actually doing a, a good thing. You know what I'm saying? You look, you think about it. The more these people are destroyed, the closer that their salvation is for, for us, man. If you really look at it, Satan, Satan is doing a very uh, good thing for the earth, man. Because this, this, these people need to be eradicated. And that's what the Lord is getting ready to, get ready to do. But but Yahweh Shai himself is going to is going to come, man. Yahweh Shai and Satan are, are a complete are a complete league, you know, they're in league with each other, man. And all the all the, and all these other spirit uh, spirits, whether it be angels and or demons, however you want to look at it, they're all in league with each other, man. They're not fighting against one another because they all have a certain or they all have a certain job. They are not fighting in one another. They are in league. That's why when you die. Is peace. There's no more confusion. If the angels and the demons were fighting each other, that means you you get ready, you get ready to get sucked into another war when you die. And it's peace when you die, when you leave this place. It's the spiritual, the spirit realm is a complete order, man. And you people don't understand. That's what? The, the way the way the Lord set everything up is as out of as out of order as this place is, it is in complete order, because this is the, this is the way the Lord wants it. This is the way the Lord wants it. The elder, you know, corrupted up by you know he said you know he was we were saying that they, the AI is rewriting the Bible completely. You know what I'm saying? Hey man, the water how old by shimmy how was shot man? Because whoever whoever get it get it. Whoever don't get it at this point. Psh. You see, the Lord is the one that's allowing all of this stuff to happen. Anyway, give it all praises, all their glory to your Howard Bosch and be able to shout out to someone.